Hi everybody, uh, I wanted to show you my current prototype. This is uh, a time fountain. Uh, the idea is to have UV fluorescent liquid dripping through uh, this point. Um, it breaks uh, a laser beam here and that allows uh, the uh, controlling hardware to time the drips with uh, these UV LEDs such that the drip of water should be able to hang in space or slowly drip down or even drip up uh, dependent upon the phase relationship and uh, this is all controlled via an Arduino and as you can see the Arduino is connected to this breakout board uh, this board provides uh, connections to the UV LEDs which are disconnected right now uh, this cable talks to the Arduino uh, this cable here talks to the laser and this most recent addition here um, talks to uh, a pump. Uh, I have this relay here because the pump is actually uh, alternating current. Um, so uh, there is uh, a transistor circuit here that then switches the relay that will turn on and off the pump. The pump is uh, from one of those cheesy Zen gardens uh, I, part I purchased over at uh, Target for about $20 and um, I currently have it connected to this copper tubing that uh, I'm trying to then develop software that would uh, time the pump correctly so I get individual drops of uh, liquid uh, from this pipe. Um, here is the software. Uh, I currently am struggling with trying to figure out the timing. Um, I have written a couple of different state machines for it, but the simplest is just to be able to turn the pump on for a specific amount of milliseconds and then turn it off. Um, and uh, I'm just going to show you a quick demonstration of that. So right now I have it set to turn on for 50 milliseconds, turn off for 20 milliseconds. And we're going to do that 100 times. Um, once I start this loop, it's going to prime the pump for uh, two seconds just to get liquid flowing through the pipe and then it will switch into the switching mode. So there we get drips but they're pretty inconsistent and uh, uh, they uh, they're not appropriate for this. What I'm looking for is a constant drip, 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 drip. Um, but I've, I've found that it's uh, pretty hard to achieve that. So we're going to turn the pump uh, um, off for 40 milliseconds and turn it on for 50. And again, we're going to do a 100 loop. So there it really didn't do anything. Um, so we'll turn the pump off for 5 milliseconds and we'll turn it on for 20 milliseconds. So as you can see it's uh, uh, in kind of this constant battle of uh, trying to figure out parameters. Uh, I've been working at this for a little while. Uh, I've thought about trying to maybe use the laser beam as a means to uh, calibrate the system, but uh, uh, you know that's uh, uh, some tough um, uh, machine learning algorithms for an Arduino to handle. Uh, I also have a PWM mode, um, but it seems to work uh, uh, even less well than the switching on and off um, but I'll just go ahead and show you so I'm gonna do a PWM uh, this is out of 255 I'm gonna do it at 202 and we're gonna run that loop again for 100 times again we have a two second prime I don't know if you're able to hear that, but you hear this kind of high whine, and that is the, PW, the PWM signal 
and going through all those various magnets and, and, and sending out this high whine. Um, so this setup, I have to admit, is a lot more finicky than I kind of hoped it to be. Um, but, uh, you know, that is, to be honest, the challenge of working with water and electronics. And I absolutely do not recommend anybody do this because they just don't mix well. Um, so I'm looking for recommendations. Uh, if anybody knows uh, a, a pretty sure shot way to get drips of liquid out of this kind of system, uh, I'm all ears. Um, but at any rate, that is my time fountain prototype, and hopefully I'm going to get beyond this state. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.